weights in my trunk. I know what you did, Christian. washing my bed sheets currently but I feel like I'm always doing that <laughs> yeah so that's what I'm doing right now um, I already showered got ready had my coffee everything like that so I'm just doing some laundry and then I'm gonna pack a bag and go hang out with Christian cuz I just wanted to go ahead and say hi and start this vlog hi. okay me and Christian are meeting at this it's like a bagel place I don't know we're getting it to go obviously and then they have like we're gonna get dinner to go from there as well and we'll just make it later I put weights in my trunk and then rolling around so he's been Christian's been looking for basically the perfect bagel sandwich for so long and he said that he finally found it here so yeah i'm excited he says it's really good and then they have like to-go food that we can just heat up or make for dinner so we don't have to leave the house again and we have dinner so that's what we're doing and i brought weights for him they're like in my trunk um but I brought weights for him from my home gym because he's like freaking out without a gym. <laughs> he's like dying. So Christian and I just met at that Italian place. I put half and half of my coffee. Um, but the coffee's really good.
Baked CD, stuffed pepper, ball, and this cucumber salad. What? Because I have it leaning up against you? Is that why you're giving me that face? We are in the Twisty Treat drive-thru. Because I want a cookie sandwich. The Thank you. It is a cookie sandwich with Reese's peanut butter cups on the outside. It's so good. Oh yeah, I'm focusing. Why aren't you focused? This is tunes. Tunes. This FedEx truck just pulled up right behind me so I can't even leave. Thank you, FedEx guy, for leaving. Happy Easter, everyone. Um, I am on my way to get some coffee. We'll chat. We need to chat because I have some stuff to say. But I need to get a sip of coffee in me first before I have this, this chat. Thank you for choosing the Starbucks. What can I get started for you? 2588. Okay, should I pull in a parking spot? Yeah, we'll okay. Thank you. I'll get water for you. Thank you. Okay. I have to pull into a parking spot. I ordered a lot of food, kind of. And they only have one warmer, so I just have to wait a little bit, which is fine because. I have my coffee. I got Christian. He really loves the medicine ball. He doesn't feel sick, but he loves the medicine ball. He's not a coffee drinker. If you watch my vlogs, you know he's not a coffee drinker. So maybe eventually I'll get him on coffee, but then again, it's really bad habit. And I don't know. It's just coffee is so delicious. I got three pumps toffee nut and almond milk. I miss this drink because I didn't have it. Did I not? No, I didn't have it last weekend or the weekend before. Right? Yeah. Another guy's coming out to give me my food. He forgot some stuff, but that's okay. I hate stuff like this. I hate like going back and being like, you forgot some of my order. I don't really like doing stuff like this. Got my. Starbucks, food, everything's in the back. Oh, yesterday I posted an Instagram photo and someone on a fake account messaged me, you edit your body, it's fake. And I was like, first of all, I work out very, very hard and like I eat very clean throughout the week and I work really hard for my body and like where I am I have good endurance and this is like the fittest I've ever been in my life for sure hands down without a doubt this is the fittest I've ever been and they obviously don't watch my YouTube videos because I'm not afraid to like 
I wear clothes that are, I wear crop tops. You can obviously see that my body is like not any different. And I would never, like I was talking to my sister about this um, a few days ago and it's just like, it's really sad that people feel the need to edit their bodies and change their bodies because of society and what society has drilled into people's heads on what is beautiful and it's sad but like for someone to come for me and say like you can edit your body it's just to make such a drastic comment or like drastic assumption on someone else through a fake account so I felt the need that I I felt like I needed to because it made me like feel kind of like self-conscious and a little bit insecure I'm not gonna lie so I literally felt like I had to post an Instagram story showing pictures from yesterday that were taken to prove a point I'm trying to be I put myself out there on the internet like I do YouTube I'm not gonna go and put pictures of myself that are edited like it's just like I can't I would not be able to live with posting a photo that was like morphed because I'd be like what if everyone knows I just couldn't do that so yeah so I felt like I needed to post an Instagram story and I was like what are we in high school like what is going on and I guess that's what you get when you put yourself out there on the internet I don't know who messaged um, me I don't know the fake account or anything like that but it was just kind of I don't know I didn't like it it made me feel like very small and less of myself and it's like dude I work really hard I work out really hard I work out five days a week and I used to do orange theory but now that it's closed I can't but I do this for myself because it feels good and the fact that someone just like I don't know it just made me feel really bad about myself and it's like that's why people have eating disorders that's why girls like will starve themselves or will um like eat too much and it's just like we live in such a fucked up world so that was like yesterday and i was like my heart was like racing during the whole time and i just felt really small and it like i hate feeling like that and i feel like ever since like high school i've been like i have like a huge target on my back i feel like people just like love to i've always been picked on i don't know but i don't want to get too into it but i don't know I don't know but yeah this is my body and I'm not afraid to show it off like you see it in videos so they obviously don't watch my YouTube videos but I made sure to send them a link to my what I eat in a day with a smiley face <laughs> but yeah I just want everyone to realize that their body is beautiful the way that it is and if you don't like something about you or how you are or how you look just change it and or don't like society doesn't define what's beautiful like you are and you define that because we're all different and we're all unique we're not all made to look a certain way but it's just like if you don't like if you don't like your hair change it if you don't like your body change it if you like we have we can change things like that's the beauty of our lives we decide what we want to change and don't change so thank you for coming to my TED talk I just want everyone to know that you guys are beautiful the way that you are. And if you don't, if you want to change something, change it. Go out and go out and follow your dreams and make your dreams a reality and love yourself. I've been talking for way too long. Okay, time to go inside and eat. Christian's probably waiting on me. He was so annoying. You know what he does? Here, I'll show you. I'm going to take off my camera. I'm going to show you what Christian does to, like, make me mad. Whenever we ride in my car, he does this. And he waits for me to notice. So, he'll, I, I like when these are straight. And he'll literally purposely go like this. And I just realized that he did that. And I was like, oh, He did it last night because we went to go get ice cream. 
and he just like purposely like he'll like wait till I'm like not looking and I won't realize that he did it and he'll like turn them and I hate the way that looks I like them like straight I don't know it's weird just a fun fact but he does that to make me mad and I'm about to go inside and say oh I, I noticed what you just did I noticed what you did to my air um what is that called where the air comes out air conditioning I know what you did Christian oh Starbucks wrote thanks a ton on my little bagel bag is it good give you the no why would they I just feel like they would. Why would they? They're gonna give me the shits. <laughs> You're disgusting. Is that on your camera? <laughs> yeah. Maybe we'll get a montage of Christian screaming at his game. Moon hits the sun like a big fire bun and some water. Two, 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 two on me, two on me. One down, one down, one down, one down. Hopefully that flank works out. Let's go. Here we go. He's exactly where I'm at too. And his buddy just per- Oh my god, bro! He sees exactly where I'm at too. How does he know where I'm shooting from? And then his teammate melts me. Hey, below. He's, uh, he's, he's to your left. He's middle, middle, back middle, middle. He threw a C4 by the flag, don't go there. Middle, back right. He's, he's camping in the spawn, back right. He's just sitting there. He's playing like a dog. Uh, dude, I'll update back left, back left. Nah. Yep, you see him. No, no, no! I don't look to the, I don't look to the left. And where is he to the left? The person upstairs just yelled at you. What'd they say? Shut up. No, they didn't. Yeah, literally right after you screamed. I heard no, it. No, they didn't. I heard it. No, they didn't. I heard it. <laughs> oh, well. All right, let's, let's get going. Fuck this spot. Shit! Let's go. On my way. Bro, I, I, this gun was it. This gun was a single automatic, bro. Siéntate, por favor. Okay, it's a lot later in the day. I'm currently on my way home to spend the rest of the day slash late afternoon slash evening with my family. Okay, I go through phases with music. I love all types of music, honestly, if it has a good beat or lyrics. This, if you like country music, disclaimer, this is such a cute, good song. I literally love it, but I'm gonna turn this off so I don't, don't get copyright and listen to the song. It's so good. I'm trying a new White Claw flavor. I didn't know they had tangerine or they also have and watermelon and lemon and lemon <laughs> we were literally just in my car and look who strikes again Look who strikes again. Christian strikes again. Moving all of my hair vents. Oh my goodness. He is literally gonna get it. I, oh my gosh. I'm just putting water in my diffuser. I feel like this definitely helps. Just, I don't know, calm. The environment i don't know if it's if it's all in my head i mean at least it's working i'm just using the lavender oil from it's from lucky's but lucky's are closed now so just smells up the room like instantly well my hair is like falling but i did just want to end off this video here christian just went home 
um we had a really good day i hope you guys had a really good day and weekend as well with your family or by yourself however you spent easter this year i know it's such a weird time but i did just want to end off this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in my next video bye